Authenticity is talked a lot about in our society. Do people like me? If I'm a candidate for office, do they want to have a beer with me? But when it comes to turning outward, authenticity is less about you and me and more about the community. There are three facets of authenticity. First, do we reflect people's reality? Are we real about the circumstances in which they live their lives and the challenges that they face? And do we square up with them about those challenges? Too often, we sugarcoat the truth when we think we're telling it because it makes us uncomfortable or we think it makes someone else uncomfortable. Sometimes we sidestep reality because we want to have a conversation about something else. Other times, we create initiatives that don't reflect reality because we think they're the right thing to do. But do they really reflect what matters to people? What people want in terms of authenticity is to be able to see and hear themselves reflected in what you say and do. The second part of authenticity is that we need to engage people in an ongoing way. So often, we show up just when it's convenient for us, when we have something to ask people to do for us, when we're doing fundraising, when we want them to support one of our programs. But what people want to know is whether or not we have an ongoing relationship with their community. Sometimes it can be hard to engage people. The folks we want to engage may not want to engage with us. Sometimes they'll turn away from us. Other times they may even turn their backs on us. But to be authentic, to exercise authenticity, we need to know these difficulties and still show up. The third part of authenticity is whether or not we see and treat each individual as a citizen, as a member of a community, not simply as a donor, as a volunteer, or maybe as a board member. So here's the intentionality test for authenticity. Do people believe you reflect their reality in what you say and do? And do they believe you have their best interests at heart even when, or maybe especially when, you disagree.